Hi everybody! Welcome back to take two of Let's Talk About It. I am here with the beautiful Bella Sheree in the building! Let's give it up for Sheree! Woo! Yes! Thank, Thank you. you! Thank you for coming! How are you? Good, good. So I'm excited about your clothing line. Thank you. I'm excited about your poetry. Thank Are you. Are you excited? Um, yeah. A little bit? Yeah. <laughs> A little bit. So you want to tell the people who you are? I am Bella Cherie. <laughs> That's right. I am a, a author, um, an entrepreneur, a mother, I know that's right. We all are at this point. Yeah. How many kids do you have? I have two. Boy and a girl? A girl yeah. No. Oh. An 18 and a 15. Woo! Mm -hmm. Honey. Yes. Black don't crack, honey. So let's get started. So what encouraged you to start your clothing line? Life. Mm. Just life. And feeling like I had like no other way to express my story, so I wrote it out mm -hmm. and then decided to pin it places, <laughs> which is absolutely dope. Yeah, because a lot of people don't take that step. Yeah. So you took that step, which is good. Thank you. And it's encouraging the others. Thank you. I appreciate it. Oh, no problem. So, what enlightened you to create your own design, Bella Sheree? That um, name is beautiful. Cherie is my middle name. Oh. Bella is what my name is, what I'm changing my name to. Right. <laughs> so yeah. I love the name Bella Cherie. I love how it, it goes together. So I'm like, that's going to be my, that's my brand right there. Awesome. Because so it's just like, I don't know, it means so much. That's dope. You're going to feel it, <laughs> taste it. Yes. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Wear it, sleep in it. Mm. Like all that sounds like Bella Cherie. So I don't know. Wow. It's just a is there a meaning behind Bella? I just happened to watch, um, what's that show? Which one? Twilight. Oh, yeah. And I fell in love with favorite. just the story. Mm -hmm. And that ever since then, I just like love that name, Bella. Wow. Like, I loved how he, he loves her, mm -hmm. how they loved on each other. Wow. That's like my awesome. Name Bella. So, what are your goals and achievements you want to accomplish with your clothing line and your poetry? Um,. I think my goal is to get us back to our roots mm -hmm. and learning where we came from and learning about the love they had back then, like getting back to that that type of love. Absolutely. So Absolutely. I think it's just my perspective. Right. On, I don't know, my culture, right. my people. Yes. And how I can get us to come back together. Which is good, because yeah. we need to come back together. Yeah. So I heard you want to start a podcast. I do. I want to start a teen podcast. Awesome. Well, I'm in the process okay. of it already. And what is it for? It's to give our children a platform to speak out and be heard because I feel like we look over them a lot. Mm -hmm. It's either we like single parents or we, we have to work two or three jobs, you know, sometimes just one parent, sometimes both parents. Right. And it's, we, we don't pay them enough attention, so they mm -hmm. look for answers in other ways. And mm -hmm. it's like stuff, we, I think we wait till stuff get out of control and then we try to step in mm -hmm. and solve the problem and see what the problem is. It's like with this, they uh, have their own space to where mm -hmm. they can say whatever it is that they want to say and then we have to be open to hearing what they what they have to say that's good because we we tend to don't listen to our kids Ooh. a lot is always shut up you young you don't know what you're talking about right. you're a child you this and it's mm -hmm. like i got a lot of shit to say yeah absolutely <laughs> and i look at my children just i think i wanted that because when i look at my children i feel like my children are my teachers and my educators absolutely. like they they taught me how to be a mother they taught me how to be a woman they taught me how to have self-love and be fearless because mm -hmm. at that age when you're a child like you fearless and you have that's so it. much confidence that's and it's, it. we the one that put the fear in our children right 
So it's like when I look at my children, I just see like different stages of myself. Like they show me who I am. Yes. And they're, they're teaching me in ways where I can, I don't know how to put it. But yeah. Well, that's good. They, they, show, they show me who I am. That's good. So okay. my goal is, one of my goals is to make them like proud and show them what they have taught me. Mm-hmm. Because if it wasn't for them, I probably wouldn't be like the woman I am right now. So come on, yeah. speak. That's so one true. of my one of my goals. And I think one of my fears is just dying without showing, making them proud. You know. Mm-hmm. I get it. That's mm-hmm. good. So, what is a typical day like for you? A typical day. I go to work. Come home. Take a shower. And create. <laughs> I just create because my brain is always like this. So right. I'm always like, I got about a thousand notebooks all yes. over the place, and yeah. there's always a pen and a notebook close by because I, I can't shut it off. Yeah. So I just go home and I create and I write. That's good. Which is going to cause you to build more and more. Right, and right, more. right. That's good. It is. Well, that's the plan. <laughs> well, it's going to. It's going yeah, to. If you believe plan. it, you have to push yourself. Right. So it's going to grow. And that's true. That is so true. So when do you think your website is going to launch? Do you have an idea? Um, I want to say in another week or two. But yeah. again, it's, every time I want to launch it, like something comes up. Right. So right. Typical. Yeah, don't know what happens to it, but yeah. <laughs> no, I'm gonna hold I'm, you to I'm it. I'm trying to get. Yeah, out. I'm gonna hold you to you it. You know what? Accountability. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's what I need. It. Yes, I need it because sometimes I like get off track a lot. We all do. Yeah, I get nobody's off track. perfect. We all do. God knows we all do. So I see you have this beautiful shirt. This is one of Bella Cherie's shirts. I am not lousy. I am not obnoxious. I am not screwed. I am not. Toxic, which is the word lost, but I am fearless. I am rapturous. I am exceptional. I am enough Which is the word free. Can you explain the shirt? Hmm. In your own words I think it's just saying that when it comes to me because I am a black woman that we get such negative feedback on a lot of a lot of situations and so this is just saying like I'm, I'm me, like I'm not lost. I'm not, I'm not what you view me as. Right. You know what I mean? I'm way, I'm way more than that. Right. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. So where can the people find you on social media? Oh shit. <laughs> I'm barely on there like that. So I don't know my name by heart, but on I'm on Instagram and I'm on Facebook and on Facebook um, I am Bella Sharian on Instagram. I believe it's underscore Bella underscore Cherie yeah. underscore three oh five. I I think. Well Cherie something to Thank them. you so thank much you for, for the opportunity. With me. Yeah. I cannot wait to this blow up. Don't thank forget you. about me though. Okay. <laughs> yeah, like you like on the train with me. Well, I got yeah. you. I got you. We together on it, so. I thank you for this opportunity. I thank you for believing in me mm-hmm. with my talk show. And I want to see you come back again. Thank you so dope. Oh, thank you. Thank you so dope. Don't you blow me up. No, huh? thank you. I appreciate nah, you. Nah, I mean, you've been dope since I since I know you. I'm quite sure you was dope before I met you. <laughs> but I you've been that. dope. So it's thank like you. everything is going to happen for you that you want to happen. It's like you my inspiration. You oh, know what I mean? Thank like, you. Like we don't see each other often or talk often, but it's like when we do, it's we start back from where we like left off it's right. like it never feels uncomfortable it never feels like we haven't spoken right months or years or seen each other absolutely so yeah that's i think that's my real friendship and it real is. just genuine connection yes yeah. it's never going anywhere sorry right. stuck with me. <laughs> so, we stuck with each other yes yeah, so thank you guys for tuning in to take two of let's talk about it uh We'll talk soon. Sure, <laughs> <laughs> okay. that was good. Mm-hmm.